Hello humans and welcome back to Seam with me, SK Drake. How are you all doing today? Alright, I have a few ships. Oh, this got destroyed by SP-353 over there. He, he didn't like that I put this uh, LCD up because it was neutral until it was fully built so he shot the hell out of it. I fixed the issue so these turrets don't target neutrals anymore. But this sen sun sensor s space slash at and then whatever rotor you want the sun sensor to control. It, it's just like this. So I got one controlling one rotor and the other one controlling the other ro rotor. These are the rotors. So this one here is the sun sensor. Bye. Okay. There you go. Sun sensor. It's not a camera. Even though it says camera, it's a sun sensor. It's controlling that rotor there and basically it just slowly rotates forever and ever because there's no sun inside here mm -hmm. but out there it'll line up the rotor you can do two rotors so if you have this pivoting like this and then we have another one here that turned it this way so you can get uh what you would do is you could either make it a no you can't make it you have to do rotor two or uh, rotor mm. comma rotor two close bracket quotes mm. i don't know if the quotes need to be there but they're there but i have three of our little sps up here they are not uh gonna patrol they're single point defenses so sp i could have put a d spd that's 351 because it's supposed to be 350 meters out. But that's the first one. That's the second one. I didn't delete antenna on it. I can control it from here, right? Yeah. Antenna. Delete. SP33 is set properly. So I just uh, gave them their waypoint and told them to fly to their waypoint and stay there. So they're out there. They'll be slowly getting turned by the rotors a little bit. Oh! Yeah, I changed up the design slightly. I gave it a bigger nose, as you can see. This cloudy light is pretty cool. Yeah, as you can see here, I extended the nose a little bit. This here, I did not catch. Oh, something spawned in. So this thruster here is burning right into this block here. And this block here. Which is probably not a good. But yeah, whatever. What's fun in? Uh, another trader. Oh, and a transport. Oh, no, that trader's been here. So right now, I'm getting these all put together. Uh, I changed up our Nanite factory again. It is now half power, half construction. So I put a whole bunch of construction upgrades. That just allows you to have more construction bots to build. So you, you can uh, add speed ones to make the construction bots fly faster. I don't know which one is faster, but I just wanted more of them so they can all get to work. We have three, so we got, yeah, four, five, and six that need to go up. Four is almost finished. And once we get our perimeter defenses up, we're going to work on our first large ship. Now, so this is how our progression has gone, I've, I've noticed. So first, we started in our little mining ship. We found an asteroid. We started our starter asteroid base here. We worked up and got our defenses. Now we're putting our outer defense grid up. We got our inner defense here. Three turrets, not a whole lot. And then we're going to have six outer defense turrets. And so now we need to move on to an asteroid eating large ship basically we're gonna abandon this base we're gonna need uh, refineries for all the ores uh, we're gonna have uh, oxygen we're gonna need oxygen for all that stuff we're gonna need uh, and uh, a hangar for our, our single small ship we got here and if we build more small ships uh, these all will be all, all this will probably be deconstructed No, 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 no. 
No. I don't know. We might deconstruct it. We might leave it here. And we can come back and visit sometime. Probably never. But, you know. It's an option. Are you finished building yet? It takes forever to build these things. No, you're not even close. Build. Build faster. We ran out of gold. I had to go get a whole shipment of gold. Oh, I... Yeah, I already told you about the changes on that. Yeah, 141k gold, another 198k gold there. You're not producing anything. You're not producing anything. Uh, yeah, we got plenty of stuff. Oh, we grab some oxygen. I have these. Detector, radio, computers, construction. Uh, give me a bonus. You can't have this. You can have 50. There we go. But yeah, two solar panels and one small reactor is not enough to keep uh, two of these engines running. That's why this thing is not going to be moving around, which is fine. It really does need to move around. How much? Oh, Archie Davis spawned in. Still seventy. Oh, I didn't get any stone because that gold deposit is freaking huge. So we pretty much wrapped up our small-scale starter, starting stuff. So now we need to work on getting our our large-scale setup which is going to be a lot of large refineries uh control panel sorter this one i want to see how many ores do we got so one two three Four, five, organic. Six, seven, eight, nine. So we need what is organic yeast? What do you make over here? Inventory. Production. Organic. Oh, that's not in yet. That's something that will be in at some point. I always keep thinking that's in. I just want to show you how I'm deploying these. Uh, I moved the projection and the repair beacon down here that way I don't have to worry about putting them on the ship grinding them down and placing them again I just have to grind this block away here send the ship out and we're good to go once it builds this last little bit here a lot of steel plates it's missing yeah, let's build that ah, I'll help you out no I won't help you out there you go I'll build all those. There. Build everything, dang it. Build faster. I think it's because uh, the projection. I didn't. Is there a projection? Gee. Alright, nanites. Power reduction, speed, medical, constructor, deconstructor, projection upgrades. Ah, I think this is what I was supposed to put up. I think that would be faster if we swap I got four construction so if we swap two of them uh, two construction and two projector uh, my inventory is pretty full and let's uh, pick up the mess I made Whoopsie. Through you. And 
Alright, make another mess. It's all good. Can pick up everything again. Oh, something spawned in. There we go. Finish you up. This uh, gets stuck with items that it cleans up, which is annoying. Yeah, you can have that and that. So this stuff can't come out once it goes in. I don't have a way to get it out yet. It's simple enough. Just uh, put a shorter here to pull out everything and s s connect that timer block to turn it on and off. Like, turn it on for five seconds every five minutes or something will help keep that from filling up. It's not a huge issue. Should be just about done. Oh, you need to finish that up. There you go. Now you're done. Control panel. Uh, projector. Complete. Okay. Let me just grind this away. Why does that look... Fake. Oh, because, uh, alright, so this one, delete antenna, there we go, turret, it is set right, okay, I set it all up, it's inventory, it's got the same, it's got this 10 uranium, your SP-354. Okay, control panel, control, uh, one way, I want you to go to number four, add, I want to control you, go G, grab the camera, view, let's raise you up. Let's uh, spin you. And look through the camera. Send you out. Yeah, I see it's, it's power is horrible. Four is which way? left. I just want to make sure it's clear before we head to the floor. There we go. So F. Um, oh, R. Let's put you there. Nope. There. There we go. Did it start working on number five here? I. Number four. Control, precision mode, mm. autopilot on, and it should mm. zip on over there. Away it goes. And 366. It's slowing down. And bam. Perfect. Now I can turn off number four. And we just got five or six to go. So once these last two are in place, I'm gonna do those uh, in between this episode and next. We're gonna start working on our first large ship. If you have ideas, or if you have uh, designs for refinery areas, because what I'm gonna have is the uh, same thing like this here. I'm gonna have a dumping point for the ore. I could go connectors, and I might have some connecting points at some point, but it's going to have the drop points, and it's going to pull in. Stone's going to get pulled off into its own storage area. All the rest is going to get pulled off into another storage area, and from that storage area, all the ore, it's going to go to ore storage. Ore storage is going to have a bleed off for any components that get pulled into it by accident. Then the rest of the ores are going to feed directly into refineries, each one set for its own ore type. And from the refinery, it's going to get pulled out and shipped to the main storage area. 
That's the flow it's going to go through. The stone is, we're going to go into the stone storage. We're going to probably not bleed any off. Oh, what just spawned it? I don't know. Uh, yeah, stone is going to go into stone, stone storage like here. Except it's going to feed into these uh, things. So we're going to need to make a... Uh, where are they? No, no, no. Oh, and there's also going to be a bleed off for ice. Can't forget that. Uh, do, do, there's something in here about stone. Stone, yeah, stone grinder, uh, metal. Electro metallurgy facility. Uh, let's go for our Denji. See if we can find them in the, the big list of everything. Might be hard. And I want to try out these docking wings and clamps. Those look pretty cool. Those are going to be used for our, our defenses. Uh, there's the stone grinder. Oh, it, it didn't matter. Stone, there we go. Give me that. And metal. So these things are pretty small. I just want to stick them right here for right now. Let's uh, put this one here. Electro. And this one here. Our base will build this stuff up. And we'll just see. Let's see how it all goes. But that's going to wrap up this episode a little short today. It's basically I'm just getting our, our outer defenses put together. Once that's all complete, I will feel a lot safer building a large ship. Definitely a different style of play than vanilla. Vanilla, usually you can just go straight to building a large ship from the start. Don't have to worry about a base or any of that stuff or any kind of defenses. I don't think I ever built turrets. It's, it's nice to have turrets. Oh, and another thing on mods. Uh, gee... I do have this mod which I am taking out, the guided missile system. It hasn't been updated in a long time and apparently it's now broken. So if you know of a, a weapons mod similar to this, you know, it, it, it doesn't do, it's not like lasers and craziness. You know, it, it's got, you know, sidewinder missiles, cruise missiles, uh, and uh, you paint your target, you know, stuff that makes sense. Uh, rail guns. Mm, I don't know about railguns. I mean, they are real, I, it, but they use a ton of power. So, if the, the I'll check out some railgun mods, and I'll look at other mods also. But if you know of any that you think are good and they're they're well balanced, they're not you know one shot kill type weapons. Let me know. Until then, take care.